Now I will tell you some important houses which are responsible, very uh, significant. Fifth house, as we know that fifth house indicates the high study. In general, as you know that fourth house indicates the primary education up to 10th class, fifth house indicates up to graduation or master degree, and ninth house indicates the PhD or postdoc. <laughs> So fifth house definitely is important because definitely a student should have good knowledge in his or her 10 plus 2 standard before he or she starts preparing for the entrance exam. So fifth house definitely is responsible. Along with this sixth house, sixth house connects with the health disease the sixth house is associated with the medical profession tenth house it is a general house which represents our profession so what are the planets placed in the tenth house that must be checked and twelfth house twelfth house does not only signify the draining it also signifies the hospital the job associated with the hospital or nursing home or any health uh, organization now some important astrological jokers it with this Jogas, a true astrologer, will be very, very affirmative with his or her prediction that this guy will prove himself or herself a renowned medical professional in his or her life. For example, I already mentioned one of this, Udaipta Yoga when Sun and Mercury is placed in the same house better if it gets placed in 6th house or 10th house but a very specific a special yoga for the medical profession that is if the 5th house lord and 10th house lord interchanges positions for example if the fifth house lord is placed in 10th house and 10th house lord is placed in fifth house for example for the ascendant aries if the sun is placed in capricorn and if the saturn is placed in leo this guy will prove himself or herself very very renowned doctor in his or her life so this is the way the prediction should be done otherwise he will always be in dark that's why I always tell I always suggest the parents that please before you Decide which profession will be suitable for your children. You should reach to an educated astrologer. And you should take from him by written that you give me unwritten. It, it should be documented that these are the technical factors. On the basis of this, you are saying that my children, my children 
will uh, will not be able to be a doctor or will be able to be a doctor what are the astrological reasons that you should ask for always <clears throat> now the dream which our children causes right from from their childhood that they have this knack to choose this profession but for the a uh, pressure uh, from the parents and they their uh, dream many times their dream doesn't uh, get the right consequence so this is not true that uh, everyone should be a doctor everyone should be an engineer everyone should be a judge a lawyer because you know that all of us are born with a specific psychosomatic pattern that come from our past karmas maybe from the past life the karmic effect gets inherited we are born with this so if our decision gets aligned with that psychosomatic pattern only then we can flourish we can be a happy human being with the profession we will always be blissful we will always be happy with our profession which we like to choose otherwise merely making a uh, money from the profession will not sustain at times the people get fatigue like myself this is my passion the astrology this domain is my passion along with the domain the engineering right from my childhood i had a knack that what is the in astrology how much it is true how much it matches with our real life and i started investigating and by luck i got some great masters those were not professional that time from them i learned so many things in astrology i consider them as my well.